Right now, I'm very happy because ever since I started in March, I've been asked the same question an awful lot, whether it's at a trade show, the recent fully charged show, online, on my own personal social media, everywhere has been, when can I get multiple all-in-ones installed? When can I add another all-in-one to my existing all-in-one? Well, today I can finally give you that date. I know it's been probably longer than you would have wanted, but we wanted to get it right. We wanted to make sure it worked from release. So the date, when can you get multiple all-in-ones? Right now, today, as you're watching this. Right now, it's out, it's available, it's fully working, it's finally here. And again, I, I wish we could have done it sooner, but better to get it out and done right than rushed out and done early. But for me alone, as I said earlier, I'm happy because that question, which I couldn't, I couldn't genuinely answer or tell anybody about because I wanted to make sure everything was working, uh, I can finally stop fielding those, those questions. So it's a bit of a selfish video is this one. But yes, you can get up to three of these. So that's a combined usable total capacity of 40.5 kilowatt hours worth of storage, which is, that, that's high end usage is that for, a, for a, a normal household anyway. And one thing I didn't realize is that you can also combine the inverters. So in theory, if you really wanted, you could have three of those giving you 18 kilowatts, 18 kilowatts of inverter power, which is bonkers. And yes, it could be anywhere in between. You don't have to use 18 if you've got three. You could just essentially use the storage and cap the power. So but all the things and all the variations have been thought of. You can get up to three as of right now. It's finally here. And well, yes, I'm sure some of you will put in the comment section, it's about time. Let me know if you're one of those people that would make use of 18 kilowatts. I'm, I'm, I can't imagine there's many out there, but there will be some, and I'm interested to know what it is you need it for. Same with the storage. I mean, I guess if you've got a heat pump and you're a full electric house, even 40 kilowatt hours is, it, it, it's possible that you would use it, you know? So there are people out there that need this sort of stuff. Um, so yeah, that's essentially all this video is for, to say, we're finally here, yes! Multiple all-in-ones. Um, so, okay, I'm done. That's it. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe and like and all the usual stuff people on YouTube tell you to do because then you don't miss out on little things like this. In fact, I would like you, if you could do me a favour, to tell other people, installers as well, that there is a Give Energy YouTube channel. The amount of people I've spoken to that install these on a near daily basis and don't know there's a YouTube channel, that's my next battle. So please do let people know that the Give Energy channel exists and uh, more people can get a uh, little you know, help and, and tips and information and all the things that the channel does. So thanks for watching. See you soon and have a good day and hopefully another all in one.